That's my shower. This is actually a good representation of how dark it is in here. Yeah. This is my shower room, and um, you can use the cup method, which is basically grab a cup, pour it over your head, that would be my head, and it goes down the drain. I have a little more high tech of a method. Having lived off grid for a little bit, I bought one of these shower doohickeys that uh, um, this goes in the water and this has a little rechargeable battery. It actually comes with two. And you hold that down and still, until it starts pumping water and you have a shower. Nothing like a morning or afternoon wetting of the head just to cool you off or... Yeah, I, I, my towel's in the other room. You pour this over your head and it goes down the drain. Actually, this is a funnel. I just figured that one out the other day. But uh, yeah, you just, uh, just a hole in the floor. That's your drain. Always open. Oh, I don't know why I poured that water down there. What a waste of water. You grab your bucket. All right, so here's another good reason to conserve on my shower water because that little electronic shower head sure does go through gallons of water. Here's the building where we get water from. Just a short walk from the, uh, um, the living quarters. But inside here is the well. And so what you do, I thought that pump would work, but it's broke. Um, instead what you do is you lower this. Looks like it's going down, I don't know, 12 feet or so. And then you raise up the water. Got knots in the rope. And pour it in your bucket. And repeat. And there's a rock on the end of that bucket, I guess, to help make sure that it it's under the water. I don't know, I think that's what, about a gallon and a half, maybe two? This is not for drinking, by the way, even through the filter. They don't recommend drinking this water. All right, and off you go. Oh, and by the way, try not to spill it. And then you come in here and you pour the water in. So 
So when I got here, this barrel was full and I have pretty much emptied half of it. So that was a lot of work for my host to do before I even got here. And then you put your bucket back and you're done. Oh, this is also where I keep all my laundry stuff. You know, my five in one, actually it's, it's six in one because I have done laundry with that. And a brush for clothes and a brush for my body. And some pins, there's the other battery. And that's, that's soap for washing with. Oh, it looks like I have a nail left. All right, yeah. So make sure you close off the light when you're done. And that's how it's done. You get your bucket, go down the hall, out the door, down the stairs, across to the well. In the well, drop the bucket, get the water, come out of the well, walk back to the stairs, up the stairs, in the building, down the dark hall, and into the barrel. Try that 20 times. Here, that's just what's done. That's just what's done.